okay hello so today I will show you how to adjust uh, the UTM thesis template uh, this one is not the original if you want the original you have to download back from the website okay you just search UTM thesis format or UTM thesis template so you can download the original one but this one is already adjusted for SKE PETG okay SKE power PE power electronic okay so you can see here this is the first page of course you have to write your title here your name okay this one you have to write your name the metric number okay uh, this one already changed don't forget to change the date okay this one you have to choose okay you can see here so if you are project you have to use a project report so master by coursework or final year project you are project report not the thesis but project report okay make sure you know the difference eh? so when you write something in this uh, in this document make sure you use report okay don't use thesis thesis is so called master by research or phd okay next uh, this one is just change the date after that this is your title name okay this one also you have to choose okay project report and this one make sure you change this okay uh, this one also the same okay make sure you change you can update this acknowledgement okay okay so you have abstract of course uh, okay abstract I suggest you when you done everything during your proposal defend okay or for your defend or your final report then you update the abstract after you finish all okay this one should be the last okay after you write that you can do the bus simulation abstract and then this is table of content and everything okay you can see here this is actually automatic okay you don't need to change this manually so you just right click okay update field right click update field it will automatically update everything okay so don't adjust this eh? just right click update field okay right click update field entire table or page number only okay next the same thing list of table right click update field okay entire table so same here list of figure automatically right click update entire table okay make sure don't adjust this you just right click update table it will do, uh, do it for you automatically so this one you have to do manually abbreviation okay you have any term that you short form it you have to put here this is the symbol any symbol that you use you have to put here and then the appendix for this one you have to right click update entire table so make sure you know the different okay so next so you can see here this is chapter one okay you can click here okay click here and go to heading okay so you can see here for power electronic usually we have introduction literature review chapter 2 chapter 3 research methodology chapter 4 result in discussion and chapter 5 conclusion and recommendation so I readjust this so you can easily do this okay so introduction is I will show you later literature review okay literature review is basically the the what you write about other people's work okay so anything that is other people's work you put it here research methodology is the work that you done okay okay if you use something from other people okay you put it here okay make sure you basically you have to write a report about your work and result in discussion is basically the output of your work okay so this is how to do it okay how to do the research and this is the output of the research and then conclusion okay and future work okay i already adjust this okay so for introduction you can see here okay for power electronic only okay for power 
mostly power and power electronic okay so you have the background of the study the first one and then you have the problem statement background of the study is just a general general writing about your your research okay it's not very detailed it's just very general then problem statement you have to show what is the current limitation or current problem with your uh, research okay what is the problem what is the gap okay so you have to show the there is a gap inside the problem statement okay and then you have research objective you can see here uh, research objective are usually in the point form so you write to what to study something to design to simulate or anything okay usually the minimum is three i repeat back minimum is three okay maximum is usually five okay so make sure you have to write the objective properly so basically most of your writing will be based on the objective scope is basically the things that you not mention in the objective so for example simulation are you doing simulation in the MATLAB or Simulink? You put it here. Okay, you usually don't put in the objective. Okay, you put it here. Are you doing hardware? Okay, this one, sometimes you can mention it in the objective. Sometimes you can mention it in here. Okay, anything that you don't mention in the objective, you can mention it in here. Okay, maybe the rating of the current, the size of the system, this one should be covered in the scope. So last one, not oh sorry, not the last one. Next one is the contribution. So basically, your research will contribute to what? So this one should be the last also. Okay, before doing abstract, okay, you should mention what is the contribution of your research. What is the advantage? Okay, don't need to do much. Okay, and then research methodology. So you can see here methodology. This is research methodology. This is research methodology. So basically, this research methodology is very general. So you put the flow chart here, and you put the gun chart here, and you can show very general. Okay, usually not more than one page. Okay, usually only one page. Okay, so this is very general research methodology. But for this one, it is a detailed research methodology. Okay, so. Now move back to the research methodology. Okay, after that you have to write the report structure. So for the report structure, okay. So for the report structure, you can see here. Ah, uh, just discuss about what is the structure of your the report. Okay. So next chapter is chapter two. Just tell what is the chapter two is all about. Chapter three is all about. No need to be long. This one is short only. Okay, this one is also short. Okay, so now we move on to chapter two. So I already placed here chapter two, and this is the heading. It's called the heading, is question, figures, and table. Okay, so how to use this? For example, let me save this first. Okay, if you want to add another chapter, chapter two point something. Okay, either you can just press enter. Okay, and you write something. Okay, you can write. Okay, so this one. This is how you add chapter. So you can see here, you are before this only 2.1 and 2.2, but now 2.1, 2.2, 2.3, and then you go back to the after you complete everything, you go to the list of table. You can see it has only 2.1, 2.2. So right click, update field, update entire table. So automatically it will add. Okay, so that is how you add it. Or another way, you just copy this. Okay, just press enter and control V. So it will automatically create a new. Okay, a new heading. Okay, same here. If you want to be more inside here, so copy control V. So it will automatically rename. Okay, but if you want to be more much more so i also provide here this one okay so if you want to be much more sub okay inside here so you just put this one okay 
so it will automatically goes more and more so this one is maximum is only for for utm thesis so that is how you create a heading so you can see here it will update here and for list of table okay table of content you have to right click update and entire okay so see it will update everything so how about equation so for equation here you can see here equation figure table okay so if you want to use it of course just copy this and then for example you want to put here control v so 2.1 right so you just highlight this press f9 at the top at your keyboard f9 it will automatically update okay so how about the figure also the same you just copy this And then put it okay and of course highlight it uh, right click okay uh, sorry uh, f9 right f9 automatically it will update okay so table also the same okay if you click here okay right click uh, sorry control v okay and then highlight it Okay, if it not update, you have highlight it and then F9. Okay, just click the F9 at the top of your keyboard. Okay, uh, one more thing that is important, you can see here. For figure, it is the caption. This is called caption is always at the bottom of the figure. But for table, the caption here is always at the top of the table. That is the format. Okay. And another thing that you need to know is, okay, how to call this number. So how to call it? So basically, you just put uh, reference, okay, cross reference, okay. So you will put here. So for example, equation, okay, just choose the equation. So for example, for this case, 2.1, just insert it. Usually we use equation E Q A T I O N. So you have to put equation. Okay. And for figure, so the same thing. Cross reference goes to figure. Okay, you can see here. But you have to change this. Instead of entire caption, you have to change to only label and number. So for this case, is figure 2.1. Okay, insert. Okay, you can see here automatically numbered. So any changes you do, it will automatically update. Okay, same as here. Right click. Okay, if you want to insert table, cross reference. Go to table. Okay, this one. Okay, table two point one. So you can see it will automatically added. Okay, so that is how you do this. Okay. And another thing that is important is if you want to uh, heading. Okay, heading also you can use it. So just choose heading. Okay, for example, chapter 2.2, this one. Okay, heading tag, heading number. Okay, you just insert. So just write section. 2.1.1 will automatically update for you. So when you want to update this, just Control All F9. Okay, Control A F9. So it automatically update everything. Okay. So another important thing is that when you want to this one refer to okay refer in text okay this one okay equation figure and table all of this needs to be refer in the text. Like this, okay. You cannot just write the equation and you don't mention it in the text. And make sure you have to mention it first, then show the equation. So, example here, equation, and at the bottom is the equation itself. Okay, so that is how you do it. Same here, you can see a figure 2.1, and the figure is at the bottom. Okay, the first time it is referred. Okay, make sure it is close. Okay, the first time it is referred to the text, you have to put the figure under there. Okay, same as table. Okay, Se uh, section, no need to worry. 
equation, okay, figure and table are important. Okay, and next is research methodology, of course, your work. So include here. Okay, and if you want to add some text here, you just copy this. Okay, it automatically format your writing. Okay, so make sure you tap this, control tap. Okay, so same here, result. So basically the output of your research. Okay, and you have chapter summary. Usually you have each chapter summary for each chapter. And lastly, okay, conclusion and recommendation. Okay, if you have don't have text, you just copy and paste. Okay. So for UTM thesis is usually four line. Okay. So four line between this. Okay, but uh, for others it is two line. So you can change it inside here. So either let me change, select the word first. It can be either four line or two line. Okay, so two line is usually between equation or figure. Four line is between the subtopic or the heading. Okay, so that is how you choose. Okay, so maybe I should give you an example here. So for this case, it is should be two line only. So paragraph two line. Okay. If it is four line, okay, this is two line. It is four line. You should change it to four line. Okay, four line is between here. Okay, table is no need to worry. Just write the table. There is no format for table. Okay. And then for the reference, you can see here this is a reference. Okay, for UTM you have four format. Okay, you can check the UTM this is uh, manual. Okay, for the PEDG, you have to basically use the, uh, the, uh, what do you call, the IEEE. Okay, so just choose this, change this to IEEE. Okay, so you have to put the reference here. Okay, put the reference here. Okay, and then the appendix, if you want to add appendix, okay, go here, this one, show. You have to add both. Okay. So copy this and then. Okay. You have to put it here. Okay. Insert here. Okay. And don't forget to break the page. Okay. So maybe I have to do this manually. Okay. And insert. Okay, layout yeah, break next page so automatically we create a new page and automatically it numbered so highlight this right click uh, sorry f9 yeah okay so it will automatically update inside here so right click update field entire this one okay I think that's it uh to turn off these symbols you just click here Home, this one okay it will hide and everything is done automatically just copy and paste copy and paste okay good luck using the template